Hello and welcome to the new Power BI video and in this video I want to show you how you can highlight the important events in the line chart. So a line chart like this and let's say you have an important event on January 2019 and the event is that launch new store in Ohio, right? So if you have a scenario like this where you want to highlight events like this on a particular date which is quite common because you may want to show that okay why the sales are picking up or why the sales are flat right so all of these scenarios is something you can highlight with the help of this which will provide more context to your user okay so before i show you this just a quick quick information about how you can get the data and how you can access all my videos very easily okay so here i am this is the sheet where i keep all of my videos and you can see it has a video title video link topic category and the difficulty level this link is present in description that way you can very easily access all of my 300 plus videos without much of a hassle uh, by going into the youtube another is the data set uh, the link is also present over here in this data set link you will come down to uh, the data sets sheet right and over here uh, the data set which is which i'm using is the sample superstore data set in the row number 19 so that way you know you can follow along me uh, based on the scenario that i'm explaining okay so how i can create it well first thing first over here only i will create it so what I need is a line chart. So I'll create a line chart and I will just expand it like I have done it till here. And uh, now what I need is the order date. In the order date, it has come with entire hierarchy. I don't need it. I need only quarter. So I'm removing the day and month and I only have year and quarter. And the next thing I know need to get is the sales still it is not like this reason for this is we need to expand it using expand all down one level so we'll click here now we have expanded everything right to the quarterly level so this now the uh, thing is how we can bring in this line so to bring this line we need to come over here in the analysis or the analytics pane in the analytics pane we need to come here on the x-axis constant line over here this is the x-axis constant line here we need to provide the date you have the option to dynamically or provide it by, via some calculation so for now what i'll do is uh, i need to go back to first january 2019 to highlight this so now if you see my line has come i can increase or decrease the transparency but then how i will bring the information will it come from data label let's try to enable that but no what it gives is only the date right it, it doesn't give me the information or the context right so for that what do we need to do is a customization customization from the perspective of adding the text box yep adding the text box and this will be we will say um launched new store in Ohio that's the trick we need to basically or component that we need to use it for our advantage and we will bring it down over here right and now uh, if I click here launch new store right now the background is coming so we can select that and we can come in effects we can uncheck the background and then its background is gone and it will feel like it is part of this so that way you can get the lines like this added into the um, into the visualization into the line chart and then you can basically say that what if if i have multiple events well no issues you can click again over here go to analysis again come to x-axis and again you have the option of adding a line add as many lines as you want right to provide better context to your users right so play around with this you know enjoy this video i hope you will find it useful if you are looking for a solution like this and i'll meet you in the next video with a new topic